can be operated from a safe position when it's mounted on a vehicle. So you better make sure that vehicle can withstand any enemy attack. Here at Blackwater Training Center, I can now reveal the latest armored personnel carrier that offers just that level of protection. This is the Grizzly. It's been designed to survive direct fire from a 50 caliber armor piercing round to blast from RPGs and roadside bombs. Built the equipment that we need to safely deliver our teams to the places they need to be. Andrew Belong plays a key role in the ongoing development of the Grizzly platform to withstand the threats posed by today's close combat situations. The current urban threats that we're experiencing now, they come in two phases. First, they'll hit you with an RPG or an IED attack. So the idea is we want to provide a, uh, uh, a resistance to that. And then also to protect against the follow-on attack of a small arms. That's why the Grizzly looks the way it does. Its diamond-shaped hull is a design feature that helps it survive an explosive blast. Primarily, what that's for is to deflect the shock wave, the blast, as it goes off underneath of a vehicle like that. Most other armored vehicles have uh, relatively flat bottoms, and that's, that's the worst thing you can have as far as a blast underneath a vehicle. Um, it allows easy penetration of frag and blast wave, and that concussion alone can kill people. Um, with the V-hull, that blast energy is deflected away from the vehicle and out uh, without providing a lot of upward force. As well, we repeat that V-shape on the sides in order to uh, deflect projectiles coming from the side. Much like the, um, the F-117 deflects radar with its very angular structure, so does the Grizzly deflect projectiles. Now we know one of the insurgent tactics nowadays is to mount 155 millimeter shells from uh, telephone poles and from walls to try and literally blow cars and trucks off the road. So we have that V shape to allow us to survive that. Well, this vehicle is made primarily to be able to safely transport multiple people from point A to point B. Um, through any dangerous area such as, you know, from Baghdad Airport to the Green Zone, which is a, a well-known bad place to be. Um, and this vehicle should be able to get people back and forth between there safely. But this is more than just an armored transporter. This Grizzly can bite. It also has rear and side gun ports so you can counter hostile fire. And you know me. I always have to test things out for myself. All right. Let's go for a little test drive. Weighing in at about 15 tons, the Grizzly has a 330 horsepower turbo diesel engine that can drive it at nearly 85 miles an hour. It can cover a range of around 400 miles without having to refuel. Tell you what, though, I definitely feel secure. You can see how thick the glass is. You can feel that it's a heavy beast. But put down on the gas. It's ready to go. But you definitely get the impression as you drive this. If you wanted something out of your way, you can get out of your way. I just want to know one thing. 